other questions? Does it include Palestinian Americans? All right, thank you, everyone. Israeli terror. What about Palestinian Americans? Thank you for giving us a chance today to talk about the number one state sponsor of terrorism, and that is Israel. And as you were speaking about every other kind of U.S. victim of terrorism, there was not one mention of Palestinian Americans or other Americans who have been murdered by Israel, which is today the number one state sponsor of terrorism. I hope you will record that because it was conveniently left out of the press conference. Thank you. So there was a press conference about victims of state sponsors of terrorism. Can you say something about it? They talked about that it was state sponsored, and then they let somebody speak about October 7th. But as a Palestinian, excuse me, as a Palestinian, they won't let me speak about my family that has been slaughtered, and over 40,000 other people who have been slaughtered in Gaza, and 15,000 of them which are children, 20,000 of them who are orphans. How dare you all be so hypocritical? And what about Palestinian Americans? Who have been Serena Bosla, what about her? As journalists, that should be coming up on your list to speak about. Let's go back to 2003. Let's go back to Rachel Corey, who was killed by Israelis, an American. No incredible investigation has been done on that. If you say that we are concerned about all victims of state-sponsored terrorism, why was there no talk about Israel, a state sponsor of terrorism that, is, uh, that has killed so many Americans? There was not one mention of Palestinians or others killed by Israel. What about Shereen Abu-Akhli, an American citizen? You're the one who's shameful, who's supporting a genocide.